Nick Chubb has quickly emerged as one of the top running backs in the NFL. With Kareem Hunt in the picture in Cleveland, what is Chubb's fantasy football outlook in 2020? Let's break it down. A second round pick out of Georgia, Chubb put together an incredibly impressive sophomore season, finishing with a stat line of 298 carries for 1,494 yards and eight touchdowns on the ground. He also added 36 receptions on 49 targets for 278 yards and zero touchdowns through the air. He finished the season as RB7 in half PPR formats, but Kareem Hunt's presence in Cleveland has cast quite a large shadow on Chubb's fantasy value moving forward. Chubb's carry counts might not have been impacted heavily by Hunt, but his fantasy production certainly was in 2019. From weeks one through nine without Kareem Hunt, Chubb averaged 19 carries a game and three receptions a game. He was RB6 over that span with almost 19 fantasy points per game. From weeks 10 through 17 when Hunt was active, Chubb saw 18 carries a game and one reception a game, finishing as RB15 over that span with 13 fantasy points per game. These splits are a bit concerning for Chubb's upside in 2020 because while he only lost one carry per game while sharing the backfield with Hunt, he also lost two receptions per game, and while some of that regression might be due to a struggling Cleveland Browns offense over the back half of the season, it definitely raises some questions about Chubb's upside. Another interesting stat about Chubb splits with and without Kareem Hunt is that while they both played in games together over the back half of the season, Hunt actually outscored Chubb in that span. Hunt scored three touchdowns to Chubb's two. So while I do think Chubb is a dominant runner, and we will certainly see big plays like this one here moving forward into 2020, there is just some concern with his upside with all the mouths to feed in Cleveland. I do think the offense will improve under new head coach Kevin Stefanski, and we saw how well he did with a heavy run scheme in Minnesota. I currently have Chubb as a high-end RB2 with low-end RB1 upside. Chubb easily could place in the top five in rushing yards again in 2020, but due to the lack of receiving work and the potential loss of a few touchdowns here and there to Kareem Hunt, I don't see him as a tier one running back. So that wraps up my fantasy outlook for Nick Chubb. Please leave a comment below for any other players you would like to see me break down next, and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. This is Alex from Double Move Sports, and we'll see you next time.